How's it going, everybody? Arthur Brace here. We're from Myers.com, and today we have one MLB game we're going to be discussing for the Wednesday, June 7, 2023 Slater game. But before we get into that, I want to talk to you guys quickly about a promotion. As you guys can sign up and get a free bonus bet every Wednesday and Saturday for a month long period by clicking the top link in the description below. We also have a link to all of our affiliate sportsbook promotional signups. So if you are in the market for a new sportsbook, if you are trying to get into sports betting for the first time and want to dip your toe into it, just get a few bonus bets. Make sure to go check that out. It has a link down below. It will bring you to all of this. Uh, sports books that are offering promotional stuff and you guys get a bonus as well as we get a tiny bit of a kickback so everybody wins at the end of the day looking at yesterday we had the blue jays minus one and a half on the money line or excuse me on the run line against the houston astros uh they were in the news a lot because of the alec manoa getting called down to the florida complex league but they were able to win they won against the astros five to one so we won our bet. We are now 77 and 63 in our last 140 video picks. Uh, in addition to the video picks, I also am writing some content on the site. Uh, my current promotion right now for all my packages on winnersandwinners.com is 60% off with the promo code MVQRST60. So make sure to go check that out. Now today we're discussing... The Boston Red Sox taking on the Cleveland Guardians in an AL matchup. It's going to be Carter Crawford on the mound for Boston. He is 1-2 and two with a 3.48 ERA. It's going to be Tanner Bibby on the mound for Cleveland. He's 1-1 one one with a 3.20 ERA. Now, I'm going to go with the Red Sox minus 1.5 here. Uh, Cleveland has been awful offensively, and Carter Crawford has just been better on the mound. Looking at Crawford's stats on the road, he has a 189 opposing batting average and a 1.88 ERA in five road games. Uh, most of those are out of the bullpen. He has one start on the road this year. Tanner Bibby has pitched well at Progressive Field, but he's doing a little bit worse. He has a 207 batting average against and a 2.74 ERA at Progressive Field this season in four home starts. So there's a bit of a difference there. The Red Sox have dominated against the AL Central this year as they are 7-2 and two against the division, including winning two out of three games to begin the year, or begin this season series against the Guardians uh, earlier in the year. And they were able to also win yesterday, so that makes them 3-1 and one now against the Guardians. In the last month of games, the Red Sox are scoring... 4.08 runs per game in the last 24 games. Cleveland in the last 25 is averaging 3.6. I think the combination of uh, Carter Crawford being a better pitcher on the road and Boston's offense obviously hitting better than Cleveland is going to have us have the Red Sox minus one and a half as our best bet for today. That's all I have for you guys, though. Make sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe if you have not already, and I will see you guys in the next one.